Hi, this is Mike, Family Dubai TV, and today we're on our way to fix a ring doorbell. All right, this is the third one that's had the same exact problem, and I'm pretty sure I know what it is. Now, let me give you the symptoms. So, you install the doorbell, everything is great for about a month, maybe six months, maybe a year, and then all of a sudden, you start losing connection, starts losing the Wi Fi, and then eventually, sometimes what happens is it just completely goes out. All right, so we're gonna do is so we're gonna go through all the steps on how to troubleshoot it and how to fix it. And I think I have the solution. It's very simple. And it's gonna work for most people. All right, so this is the dead ring. Like I've said, I've seen this three different times. Well, I'm gonna show you a few things you can do to troubleshoot yours. The first thing we're gonna do is check continuity of the wire. And because this is the last thing you probably messed with, the last wire, we're gonna check the wires right here. So what we need is a special ring tool and then we got to take these screws off and what this is going to do is expose the wiring and what we're going to do is we're going to look at these wires and make sure that everything is connected and we see that everything is connected all right so we know the wires here are not the problem so now we're going to move on to the next junction point all right so the next junction point is where the actual bell is where the noise comes out of all right and what we want to do in here is we want to look in here and make sure that nothing is loose and there's no wires loose in there okay once again everything looks here good here so now the next step for us is we're going to go downstairs and go find the transformer likely your transformer is going to be near your electrical box so go find your electrical box this is the transformer okay so what this does this actually takes the 120 volts from here and it knocks it down to 24 volts which is what the ring doorbell needs. So this wire right here is actually going to the doorbell. All right, now you may have transformers in your house for other things, so you gotta make sure that it's the right transformer, but I'm 99% sure that this is the problem, okay? That there's not 24 volts coming out of this transformer, okay? So we have our meter. Here's an outlet that works. I get 120 volts. When I touch the leads on here, I actually get 24 volts and touch the leads. And you can see this thing is completely dead. I don't know what happened to it. One of two things happened. Inside the box, whatever wire is going to this transformer got disconnected. And when we open this up, we'll see if that's the case, but I doubt that's the case. What I'm thinking is that this transformer went bad. They're super easy to replace and they're actually super cheap. So I'll put a link down below so you can pick one up. But right now we're gonna replace this trans and get this ring going. So I'd say most transformers are probably connected to the side of the box. Uh, so be very careful when you do this. Seriously, don't do this if you're not, don't go into this box, open this box if you're not comfortable. All right, so you can see here how the transformer is connected to the inside of the box. All right, so we have our ground that's coming in and then we have it basically just wired nut. This is how they always do it. They just have it wired nut, nutted together uh, with some other wires in here. So this is what the transformer looks like. These are the two screws that it goes into and these are the wires that go inside the box. This is the screw that holds it on right here. So before you start messing with these wires, what I would recommend is that you at least turn off the circuit that this transformer is connected to. It's actually pretty simple. If, you, if I follow this black wire, I can see that it's loop, it loops out and it connects into this circuit right here. So I'm gonna turn this circuit off before I start messing with this. Out with the old, in with the new. So now we're gonna install this in just reverse. So this will go to the white wire, black wire, ground, and then we'll connect our two 24 volt wires to our bell wire here. All right, so it's before I install this into there, I'm gonna put the two wires on here. Continuity doesn't matter, meaning I can put the red and black on whichever side. <laughs> turn the power back on we don't see any sparks now that we got the transformer in there let's see if we have voltage see what we got and yep now you see we got we got voltage coming out all right for the moment of truth i think i see a light on here yep we're back and we're working all right so that's how you fix a dead ring door just to recap basically check your continuity so check all the wires uh behind here at the door at the transformer if everything looks good and you have a house probably built in like the early 2000s or below, most likely it's a transformer because those transformers are not designed for these new fancy doorbells. All right, so go get yourself a transformer. I'll put a link down below. 
please hit the subscribe button. Please hit the follow button. I'm Mike, found me TV, and I'm out. That's how you fix a ring, a dead...